If I'm going to be showing you my morning routine, then I got to show you the truth. Let's dial it back. Let's be honest. Those mornings as a 21-year-old struggling college student aren't always inspiring. It's hard to find motivation to get out of bed. I mean, it wasn't because I was working till 7 a.m., it's not because I was studying on a coffee-fueled rage. And nah, I wasn't out partying. I mean, we're in a Panasonic. In this moment, I am selfishly living in comfort. Away from the mixed fear of possible anxiety, hardship, and, you know, the random episode of depression that I might encounter in the day. In this moment, I have peace. Don't get me wrong. There are plenty of healthier ways of getting up in the morning that I'm aware of. So let me go find those ways by going on YouTube and looking up an aesthetically pleasing routine that the vlogger themselves probably doesn't even follow on the daily. I often ask myself, why do we do that? Then I remember we live in this digital age ruled by social media algorithms and likes that we get so caught up on displaying what pleases the eye rather than living as our authentic selves. We hide our mistakes and we vilify anything that's not a part of the facade or what would gain us the internet traction. It's how we end up in the comparison and self-sabotage game. We wind up into a headspace where we can't forgive ourselves or be vulnerable enough to admit and change the habits that may be hindering our mental health. I think it all just starts with acceptance and forgiveness. So here, let me start first. I don't wake up with energy. Instead of working out, I check social media. As soon as I hit the bathroom, I answer nature's call before I dress down. And I don't meditate like a monk, but I do give myself time to pause in my own way. Thing is, I accept all of these faults. These are the parts of us that makes us human. So yeah, I'm going to have my lazy mornings and I'm also going to have my productive ones too. And that's okay. Accepting those things is accepting life for what it is. Embracing those down moments makes us as valid as the person who strives for the good days too.